Hi, Hiram here. I wanted to do a quick show on something that I got on eBay. It's this. It's called a portable stainless steel alcohol burner lamp with a keychain key ring. I looked at this on eBay. I thought this might make a nice little survival item. So I thought maybe I got a couple of them. I thought I'd give you a show here. I'm going to do some playing with this later on, but I just wanted to kind of give you a show on this before they disappear on eBay. If you do a search on portable stainless steel alcohol burner, this should come up. Uh, they were, what, $3.45 each plus $0.49 cents shipping. Now, it does come from China, but today anymore, what doesn't? What you have is a little tubular affair. It unscrews. Let me, let me do it with this one. This one's empty. The top screws off, and then you have this thing on the inside. This unscrews, and it shows you the wick on there. Now, this part may be stainless steel, but this cap that goes onto the burner to hold in the alcohol sure feels like plastic so be careful with this but the rest of it seems pretty strong now I'm thinking this will make a nice survival tool I have a uh, lighter that's about the same shape but a little bit smaller so what you do is this part opens too and then you have like oh, black you can't see there's a tank here that you put alcohol in just stick the little wick come on down in it and you have yourself a little burner now the bottom's a little more rounded than what I thought it would be but it is sort of flat so it'll stay there like that what I'm thinking is poking a hole in the ground sticking this down in and then just set a couple rocks and you can heat up a cup of water maybe not get it to boil but you can heat up a cup of water so I put some alcohol in this one. Uh, these things, <clears throat> the weight on this empty was 32.2 grams or 1.14 ounces. I filled it up with methanol and it, and it took the weight up to 38.2 grams or 1.35 ounces. So there's about uh, 6 grams of alcohol methanol in here which should give you a little bit of a burn so what you do is you just pull the wick up to whatever height you want give it a light let me see oh, can you see the flames there Not a big flame, but it is warm enough that you set a cup on top of that, and I'm sure it'll heat it up for you. Like I said, I'm just giving you a quick show on this. You can go on eBay and find them. If you pull the wick out more, I assume it'll, it'll give you a little bit bigger flame. But in a survival... Yeah, that's a little warm. In a survival situation, that could mean the difference between, you know, kicking it or not. So that's the... Now, the thing I was saying with this plastic top. Oh, maybe it's metal. Sure feels plastic. But anyway, I'd blow this out first, let it cool, and then put this top on. One, so you don't melt. There's an O-ring on the inside. You don't want to melt that down. But also you want this to cool off before you put that on so it doesn't form a vapor lock. There is a little pinhole right here to let the vapors out so this thing doesn't explode when it gets hot. So I just let everything cool off and then screw it up tight. This could be put on your survival chain. It comes with a clip. So you can, for those of you that got those uh, survival necklaces and whatnot, this would fit on there. Like I said, I have a a lighter that's just about the same shape, a little bit smaller. So that's the portable stainless steel 
alcohol burner lamp. If you're interested, do an eBay check, and you should find them there. I thank you for watching. I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, helpful suggestions. And as always, watch for my buddy Max. Bye now.